All right, guys, welcome back to the Mercenaries. We are playing on this map called Missile Area, and we are playing as Chris Redfield, BSAA. All right, so I've been um, playing this map a little bit just to get the hang of it, so I can um, not look like a complete idiot. Um, also, I've been like really. Yeah, I forgot, they don't even blow up. Resident Evil 4, they fucking blow up whenever you kill them. But I've noticed they don't really do that a whole lot in here. Maybe I'm just getting lucky, but I don't know. Anyway, I've been playing this map a little bit to get the hang of it. Get the hang of, like, the locations of the times and stuff. I'm, I don't have it down 100%, but I have a good idea. Especially considering where I was at after I finished up the previous map. So I've, I've been uh, just, I just want to do that so I don't look like a complete moron running around trying to get everything whenever I don't know where anything's at. Because I'll tell you, whenever I picked it up, I was messing around with it and I played it again for the first time and however long it's been, did not know a goddamn thing. It was pretty rough. But anyway, I also, I've been doing a lot of like practicing and stuff, and I've been getting some pretty decent scores. So hopefully, I can continue this in this video. Alright, I'm out of. Storage. I want to try to keep this. Well, oh, fuck. Try to keep this combo up for as long as I can. I found with this crit. Fucking Christ. With this Chris, you gotta like shoot him in the body and then shoot him in the head if you want to kill him on the punch. Sometimes it doesn't kill him right away, and that's never oh, okay. Just fucking miss it. What the fuck? This map has a really annoying amount of people with Molotovs and dynamite. It's it's fucking annoying. That uh, the amount of dynamite and Molotovs. Coupled with whenever they grow their second head is the main reasons why I lose my combos. Or at least it is whenever I've been uh, going through and playing it. But really, uh, my strategy for this map is I just like to go around and collect some time, and then whenever I get to one of the areas with the time bonus, I just kind of set up there for a little bit and try to get a combo. But there's, a, I think, a 90 second or a 60 second time in here, which is pretty useful in a handful of grenades. Which, for Machine Gun Dude, I'm going to use them on. Oh, fuck! Might as well use that as well. Wow. Fucking, he didn't even get hit by the nade. I'm just trying to lock him into a stun so I can run up on him with a shotgun. Chris, this Chris, you know, his loadout isn't awful, but he's really tough whenever, it's really tough to use him whenever you get, you have the mini bosses, because his loadout isn't awful when it comes to just dealing with regular people, because he has a pistol, he has this uh, Beretta, which is, you know, it's okay, it's not, it's not great, but it's okay. 
And then he has the shotgun, which is also pretty good for dealing with people. And honestly, right now I have no idea what I'm doing. I mean, I do. I'm going to go grab this time, but I didn't really need to. Yeah, especially at fucking 90 second. Holy shit. Whenever you got, have to deal with the bosses, it's just kind of hard. You gotta like keep running up on them with the shotgun and hope you lock them into a stun, or you're gonna have some issues. Regardless, he isn't awful. I'm gonna try to build up a combo real quick. I'm actually... I'm like trying to stay up for a while to reset my sleep cycle because I'm kind of fucked up right now. I messed myself up over the weekend, and I have school this week, so you know, you gotta definitely get back on track. And I'm procrastinating pretty bad because I have some research I have to do for one of my classes. I haven't started on it yet, and I meant to do it tonight. But, you know, fuck me right, because I procrastinate on everything. It's one of my biggest downfall, like, um,. My biggest um, weakness when it comes to fucking school is that I procrastinate all the time. I know a lot of people do, you know, I'm not alone in that, but it's definitely... It's not something that I'm proud of. It usually doesn't, like, result in bad grades because, like, I do decent on the work itself but what it does do is just stress me out I don't know why I threw that flash I'm glad that guy was right there well, I took him out pretty quick, actually. Remember JJ? Um, I don't know if that's what he's called in this game, but JJ in Resident Evil 4 is kind of a bitch. He goes out pretty quick. But I do want to remind you guys that this video isn't necessary, or the series that I have here with mercenaries isn't about high scores. It's about um, how to get um, an S rank. So you, well, you only need an A rank. You don't need an S. Damn, he just fucking went flying. It's about to get the um, S rank. So, or an A at the very least, like I was saying. Sorry, my count commentary is probably all over the place right now. I'm just a little, a little tired and stressed out from the school stuff I'm procrastinating on. Man, are you fucking kidding me? I had a 50 combo and I lost it because this fucking one do his stupid fucking shit and that always happens. There is one more uh, JJ that's going to spawn in here in a second. Uh, the last one, I believe. But I just want to remind you, just, uh, you know, I don't mention it a whole lot, and I just, I want it to, I want this guide to be kind of like a simple thing to follow. I, dude, I watch some people play Mercenaries, and they, and I'm just sitting here like, I've been playing, you know, I've, been, I've played Resident Evil 5 Mercenaries since it came out, and, you know, I'm not the best at it by any means, but I'm not fucking awful at it either. And then I'm watching these people doing shit that I've never seen before. It's insane. So I don't want, like, this. and it, the, my goal with this is for, like, you know, just e either newcomers, because there are a lot of newcomers with Resident Evil 5. Cause I've, 
I really didn't even know this until um, somebody pointed it out, but I mean, they have a remaster. I don't know if it's remastered, but they released it for the PS4 and Xbox One. I've just been playing it on the PC. It's been out for the PC for a long ass time. I've just been playing it on that. Of course, the first time I ever had it was on the 360. I don't have it on a PS4 or Xbox One. And I actually, I, I was watching some mercenary videos of... What the fuck? I was watching some mercenary videos of the PS4 and it's different. Like, it's called Mercenaries United. And it's, um... Okay, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. They have different, like, fucking melee moves and shit. It's weird. We're not completely different. It's pretty much the same, but whenever... I noticed whenever they were collecting Tom, it was... They did different animations for collecting it. Like, Chris would just kick it instead of punching it. I don't know, it's weird. Anyway. And uh, whenever, in Mercenaries Unite, it has like all the characters like from Reunion and um... Reunion, I, oh my god. The Re Reunion and the regular Mercenaries. So, yeah, that looks pretty cool, but I can't play it because I don't have a PS... Well, I do have a PS4, but I don't have this game on it. I don't really plan on getting it because, I, like I said, I already have it for the P PC. There's literally no reason for me to get it on the consoles. Oh, shit. I'm just trying to avoid this guy. I have 100,000. I don't even remember when I got this score, but... Like, he's fucking me up. And this guy's about to fuck me up, too. But I'm just trying to survive with this score. Uh, I do apologize. I know my fucking commentary's been a little weird. Like I said, I'm kind of tired and just stressed out right now. And I just wanted to make a video for the fuck of it. Just, um, kind of chill out. You know, make this video. I haven't made a video in about a week since I've made that weapon walkthrough thing, or not weapon walkthrough, weapon, weapon showcase for Resident Evil 4, I haven't made a video since then, but 50 combo, 116 enemies killed, 116,000 for a double S, not too shabby for Chris BSAA, uh, up next will be Chris Safari, so stay tuned for that and thank you all for watching.